హలో వరల్డ్ గుడ్ మార్నింగ్ గుడ్ ఆఫ్టర్నూన్ గుడ్ ఈవినింగ్ వెల్కమ్ బ్యాక్ టు కోడింగ్ సైంటిస్ డాట్ కామ్ వీ ఆర్ హియర్ టుడే విత్ అ న్యూ అండ్ బ్యూటిఫుల్ సిరీస్ అ బ్రాండ్ న్యూ జీరో టు హీరో సిరీస్ కాల్డ్ మషీన్ లర్నింగ్ ఆన్ ఆడినో బిఎల్ఇ సెన్స్ ఇన్ దిస్ పర్టిక్యులర్ సిరీస్ ఆఫ్ లెసన్స్ ఐ విల్ వాక్ యూ థ్రూ స్టెప్ బై స్టెప్ ఇన్స్ట్రక్షన్స్ టు బిల్డ్ సెవరల్ మషీన్ లర్నింగ్ ప్రాజెక్ట్స్ రోబోటిక్స్ and iot projects from the scratch using arduino 33 ble sense board so what is basically ble sense guys you know i i'm sure many of you from the arduino world would have definitely explored this particular board which was released about i think about a year back less than a year back uh, but for those of you who are totally beginners who are new to embedded system who are totally new to robotics ai and electronics this is the right place because in this series i am going to start from the ground zero from the scratch from the basics to the pretty advanced level of ai machine learning and robotics and iot stuff using just a single board so what is ble sense so let's take a look at uh, some of the aspects of this board guys you know i let me this is an introduction lesson i'm going to talk more about the board and what we are going to do in the upcoming lessons and stuff like that all right so what is ble sense so it's it's a very small you know board as simple as that you know it it's very easy to define it looks very small as you can see in the picture you can just hold it it's a tiny little chip right so uh, basically what what we will be doing is you know using the nano ble sense it it's basically a 3.3 volt you know uh, uh, the power which consumes in this board it is just a uh, you know you can use one single battery 8650 rechargeable battery to plug it in and connect it to your usb and run ton loads of things so that is what i can explain but however if you look at the data sheet in arduino side it's pretty it's it's pretty powerful so basically it's a 3.3 volt ai enabled board artificial intelligence enabled board in the smallest available form factor and the size is just 45 into 18 mm that's this much that's it the arduino 33 ble sense is actually a very fantastic all in one microcontroller unit on a well known small form factor it also comes with a series of embedded sensors most important thing to note about this particular board about this microchip board it comes with embedded sensors that means you know ton loads of sensors is already in built you don't have to buy any sensors at all right let's take a look at it what exactly those sensors are which are embedded within this particular chip so let me just show you this is the overall uh, uh, you know a high level picture of what exactly what types of sensors are inbuilt within the board so you can you can just take a look at this picture so basically this has got nine axis imu inertial sensor so this also means that you don't have to buy any additional imu sensors from the market for example if you are using arduino uno or nano or mega or any of those boards microcontroller boards you end up buying different kinds of sensors and if you want to build a kind of self balancing robot or any hand gesture control bots and kind of thing you have to go for a imu either mpu 6050 or or any other six axis or nine axis mpu boards from the market and it works out pretty expensive right but in ble sense this has got a inbuilt 9 axis you know 9 axis gyro 9 axis sensor 9 axis imu if you take a look at this picture you can do ton loads of thing in various dimensions various degrees of motions and so many things you can play around guys you know so many things you can play around anyways i'll talk about the imu at a later stage what we can do from the sensor point of view from the inbuilt sensor point of view apart from the nine axis inertial sensor this also has a humidity and temperature sensor so you can imagine that blue color sensor which we used to buy for arduino uno and nano we don't need that anymore because this board comes with a inbuilt humidity and temperature 
to get highly accurate measurements of environment conditions. So this opens up a ton loads of opportunity for us to make several IoT, Internet of Things applications using just a single board and powering with 3.7 volt battery. That's more than enough. The, another sensor is the barometric sensor. You could also make a very simple weather station, you know, uh, looking at the weather in any of the farmhouse or any, any of the agricultural unit. We can check the weather. We can also check the humidity and the temperature and send some information back to our browser. All those things are possible. Now, the most important aspect is this board has got an inbuilt microphone. So basically, we can capture and analyze sound in real time. You know, just imagine how, what kind of magics we can do. You know, we can capture sound input, take an input, build an algorithm, train those algorithms, you know, train the model, deploy into the same board and make it work. Just imagine, guys, we are talking about artificial intelligence here using this board. And then we have the gesture proximity, light color and light intensity sensor. Wow, this is amazing, which can basically estimate the room's light uh, you know, the value, the luminosity, right? Whether how bright it is and how low it is and all those things. But also whether someone is moving close to the board or not. So basically can, it'll act as a motion sensor as well. So you can imagine guys, the, the kind of ample amount of doors it has opened up. We can build several applications, robotics application, especially using this particular board. And then it's got a Bluetooth and a BLE. The communication chipset of Nano BLE Sense can be both BLE and Bluetooth client and host a device, which is something pretty unique in the world of microcontroller platforms, right? So let's take a look at it. What exactly you will learn from, from this particular series. So before we get into the, the gyro aspects, the IMU aspects, I would like to show how this board looks like and what you will be learning out of the series. Of course, I'm, I'm targeting to build at least, you know, about 25 to 30 different lessons. And the lessons will cover from all the way from basic scratch, you know, very, very ground zero level to advanced level so that you can, you know, we can start building uh, projects and stuff like that. So let's let's take a look at in terms of what you will be learning from this particular series. Obviously, the main focus of this particular series is going to be embedded artificial intelligence. The main features of this board, besides the very impressive selection of sensors, which I just showed you, is the possibility of running edge computing application, AI, you know, on the edge, AI on the edge. You don't need a Jetson Nano kind of, you know, expensive board to run a small application, tiny AI kind of thing. But we can go for 33 BLE sense board from Arduino. So the edge AI application on it using, we will be using tiny ML, basically the tiny machine learning. You can create your own machine learning models using TensorFlow Lite. I will show you how to compile and build your TensorFlow Lite in this particular board, within this board, okay? You can just upload it, run your model, and boom, there you go. You have your machine learning stuff working on your Arduino. All right, and then we will also build IoT projects. You know, since we already have ton loads of built-in sensors within this board, I will show you how to build so from basics to advanced level of IoT projects and deploy those in a real time. And of course comes the robotics projects. We will build a couple of bots, robots, especially the gesture control robots since we have the IMU inbuilt. We can also build a drone, a small drone. So all those possibilities are open up. So I will show you each and everything step by step systematically guys. Now what we can do is let me show you, uh, you know, so I'll be using, I'll be, uh, we have something called tiny ML kit. So this is how it looks like. This is a tiny ML kit. Okay. So this kit comes, if, if you guys are interested to buy this kit, let me know, you know, we are the authorized uh, resellers for, for this particular uh, kit and I can, I can get it to you pretty quick as soon as possible. So let's take a look at it. What exactly comes along with this kit? I'll just open this box. So we will have our, there you go, you can see 
Arduino 33 BLE chip. Guys, it's really small. Can you see that? It, the best part is it comes with the header pin. So we don't have to do the soldering and kind of thing. So it comes with the header pins. Very nice. The best part about this kit is it's got a expansion board, which is pretty good. We can put the chip here on top of this and we can connect our sensors to all the six different ports and also a camera and you know ton loads of things and uh, what else yeah this has got a camera this kit comes along with a small ArduCam camera you can see it here and then the usb connectivity cable of course so you know uh, initially what we will do is we will use the breadboard so i think that is the best way to learn and over a period of time we will get into uh, you know using this expansion board it, it's it's nothing but similar to a breadboard but it, it's always better to connect to connect this arduino 33 ble to breadboard and uh, we will start doing some magic guys all right if you are interested in this kit do let me know leave a message i'll be happy to get one for you and i will ship it to your home so uh, EDX has got a special course, you know, EDX platform from Coursera and uh, MIT. All these guys are opting for this particular course using TinyML learning kit. Especially when you are running, when you are working on TensorFlow and machine learning, this kit comes. With, this is very very helpful kit. But these courses are very expensive, guys. Very expensive course. I suggest you know uh, if you want to go ahead and follow those course, you are obviously feel free you know you will get certification from uh, Coursera and stuff like that and EDX but here in this tutorial series I am going to walk you through everything from basics from zero to hero level and it's absolutely free of course so it's your call all right guys so I'll be back soon do go ahead and arrange for 33 BLE board with a breadboard few jumper wires uh, if possible, uh, get an ArduCam uh, camera, uh, which is available on Amazon or anywhere. You get the separate 33 BLE board uh, from, from the open source market from Amazon on, or many other platforms as well. But if you want the entire kit, the tiny ML kit from me, it's just an addition of uh, camera and the USB cord and, and, and the expansion board, you know, nothing else with a beautiful little box, of course. So do reach out to me. Any which ways you can follow along and uh, I will look forward to seeing you in the first project which is going to come soon, very soon. Goodbye.